What if I told you this fearless little hero, saving a lost baby, wasn't created in a studio? No animators, no expensive gear, just free AI tools and a bold imagination. Now let me show you what happens when storytelling meets strategy and emotion meets algorithm. There's a channel called Yellow Chicks, just two months old, only 43 videos, already over 2.44 million subscribers. In one month, silver and gold play buttons. Not luck, precision, emotion, intent. The creator plays with emotion masterfully, crafting stories that are heartwarming, dramatic, even heartbreaking. People watch, re-watch, and share, and the YouTube algorithm pushes it to millions. In this video, I'll show you exactly how you can do the same, using free AI tools to create emotional, cinematic stories. No team, no code, just your creativity, and the exact process I'm about to reveal. Stick around, because I'm showing you everything. Step one, chat GPT image prompt every great animated video starts with one thing a story that pulls you in but don't worry you don't need to be a writer to make that happen we're going to let chat GPT handle that for us all I did was open chat GPT and type a simple prompt give me story ideas where a yellow chick is a superhero who saves the lives of a baby and their mother that's it you don't need fancy language just imagination and the right questions to help guide it, I added a few examples for inspiration. River Escape, Crocodile Crossing, Black Panther in the Jungle, Wolf in the Woods. Within seconds, ChatGPT spun out emotional, action-packed storylines ready for animation. This is where the magic begins. This is the most important part of the entire video. Don't skip, don't zone out, because this is where most beginners give up. They get stuck, not knowing how to write a story, especially how to write the right image prompts for story using ChatGPT. But once you understand this part, everything else gets easier, faster, even fun. And just like that, ChatGPT delivered seven powerful story ideas, each one packed with emotion, action, and heart, all from a single prompt. Take a look. This is the kind of creative firepower you're unlocking instantly. You can pick any of these ideas to bring to life. But me? I'm going with Crocodile Crossing. There's something about that scene, the tension, the danger, that just pulls you in. I highlighted the Crocodile Crossing story idea and clicked the reply button. That instantly brought the idea into the chat box, ready to expand. Then I gave ChatGPT a powerful follow-up command. I like this idea, now please write the story along with image prompts for each scene to generate the visuals. Consistency is the most important factor. I will provide you with the main character details. You should add these character details whenever the character appear in the scene so the AI can generate consistent images. After that follow-up command, I simply pasted in the character details. The mother, the baby, and the fearless yellow chick hero. Then I hit the generate button. And just like that, ChatGPT unlocked the full workflow. A complete story, detailed scene-by-scene -scene image prompts. But here's something I noticed, and it's really important if you want consistent visuals. ChatGPT added the character details in the first image prompt, but in the rest of the scenes, those details started fading out. That's a common mistake, and one that can break visual consistency if you're not careful. But don't worry, I'll show you exactly how to fix it and make sure every single scene stays locked on your characters perfectly. So here's what I did next. I gave ChatGPT a follow-up prompt, just to be sure, then pasted the character details again right below it. And once everything was in place, I clicked the generate button again. That locked in the descriptions and made sure every single image prompt kept the characters perfectly consistent from scene to scene. You'll find all of these prompts, along with the full character descriptions, waiting for you in the comment section below. And now, as you can see, this time, ChatGPT nailed it. The image prompts came out perfectly, with all the character details locked in for every single scene. This is exactly what we want, and I'm fully satisfied with the results. Step two, text to image. Now that we've got our story and perfectly detailed prompts, it's time for the next step, bringing those scenes to life. For that, I'm using one of the most advanced free text to image tools available right now, Piclamen AI. It's fast, it's powerful, and it's built to handle cinematic prompts, just like the ones we're about to generate. Let me show you exactly how to turn your story into stunning, consistent visuals, scene by scene. All right, as you can see, I've opened up Piclumen AI. Now, I'll simply paste the first image prompt into the input box. Next, I'll select the model, Flux, one Schnell, perfect for rich cinematic results. Then I'll set the aspect ratio to 16.9, so it fits a wide cinematic frame. And I'll choose two images per batch, just to explore some visual variety. Finally, I click the Generate button and let the AI do its magic. Now it takes just a moment for Piclamen to generate the images. And here we go, two results. The first image, not quite right, eh, the baby has two heads. But the second one, that's spot on. Clean, emotional, and exactly what I was aiming for. And here's the beauty of it. If you're not happy with the results, you can always regenerate by clicking the Return button. That's what I did. And just like that, Piclamen gave me two fresh options. This time, the second image again, absolutely 
absolutely perfect. And once you find the image you like, it's simple. Just click this download button and it's yours. From here, the process is simple and repeatable. I just copy each prompt, paste it into Pikleman AI, set the same settings, and click Generate. If the image doesn't come out quite right, no problem. I just hit the return button to regenerate and keep going until I get the perfect visual for that scene. Pro tip, if you really want to enhance the storytelling, don't settle for just one or two images per scene. Instead, try generating two or three variations for each moment. This gives you more options to work with, helps you build better visual continuity, and adds a whole new level of cinematic quality to your story. Now, if you want to explore another powerful option, you can also try Ideogram AI, another great free tool for generating high quality images from text prompts. As you can see, I've opened Ideogram and pasted in the same image prompt. I'm keeping the aspect ratio at 16.9 using the default settings, and then I click Generate. Within seconds, Ideogram gives me four visual variations to choose from, all based on the same prompt. Some of these look even better in certain ways. But here's my suggestion. Stick with Pikleman AI for your main workflow, because it offers more free generations and gives you greater flexibility as your story grows. Use Ideogram for support, but let Pikleman carry the main load. These are the final images I created using Pikleman AI, and now it's time to bring them to life. I've arranged them scene by scene, so it'll be easy to manage the visuals as we animate the full story. We're going to use one of the most powerful free tools made for creators like us, an AI that turns your images into smooth, cinematic videos in just a few clicks. No editing skills, no complex software, just upload your images and watch your story move. Let's bring every scene to life, frame by frame. As you can see, I've opened Kling AI, and after logging in, I'll simply click on the video button. Here, we've got three options, text to video, image to video, and multiple elements. Since we've already created all our visuals, I'm going to select the image to video option. Next, I'll click the upload button and choose the image for our first scene. As you can see, the image is uploaded, and now I just need to guide Kling AI with a simple animation hint. This is where the magic happens. I've entered a basic prompt describing how I want the scene to move. Then I click on the DeepSeek button. DeepSeek now analyzes both the image and the prompt, and in just a few seconds, it transforms that into a refined cinematic video prompt. As you can see, DeepSeek has now generated the perfect video prompt for Kling AI, fully tailored to our image and animation idea. Now all I have to do is click on the Use Prompt button. Now it's time to choose the video duration. You can go with five or 10 seconds, depending on the scene and pacing. For this one, I'm selecting five seconds, just enough to capture the moment with impact. Then I click the Generate button and Kling AI gets to work, transforming our image into a moving cinematic scene. In the free version, Kling AI takes a bit of time to generate the video, usually around 10 to 15 minutes, and sometimes even longer depending on server load. But if you're using the paid subscription, the generation is much faster. So if you're sticking with free for now, just be patient because what you're about to get is absolutely worth the wait. Here's another powerful free AI tool for video generation. It's called Hiluo AI, and it's definitely worth checking out. As you can see, I've already logged in. And if it's your first time, you'll get 1,100 free credits to start just for signing up. Once you're in, simply click the Create Video. You'll notice the interface looks very similar to Kling AI, clean and simple. Just click on the Upload button, then upload the first scene image, just like we did before. Now I'll take the exact same prompt we used in Kling AI and paste it right here into Hiluo AI. If you click this camera button, a new window pops up. Here you can customize the camera movements for your scene. But for now, I'm going to leave it on default and simply click the Generate button. It'll take a little time to generate the video, especially if you're using the free version. The video is generated, it looks good, but if you're not completely happy with it, no worries. You always have the option to regenerate and try again. Both videos from Halo AI have finished generating, but I noticed something important. There's not much motion in the scenes. The animation feels a bit too static, and as you can see in the second Hiluo AI video, the water looks completely still. No ripples, no motion, just a frozen frame. But wait until you see the Kling AI version. The difference is night and day. You're going to be amazed by what it can do. You can clearly see the video quality from Kling AI is on another level. The woman's movement, the subtle motions, everything feels alive and beautifully cinematic. And once you're happy with the result, just click this download button and your scene is ready to go. And in the same way, I'll go scene by scene, uploading each image, refining the animation prompt with DeepSeek, and generating the videos using Kling AI. If a result doesn't hit the mark, 
no problem. I'll regenerate until it's just right. I'll also use Hiluo AI as a backup, just in case I need more variations or want to test a different vibe. Once all the videos are generated, I'll show you the full transformation. Step four, cap cut video editing, and here it is. These are the final videos I've generated using Kling AI and Heiluo AI. Now that we've got our scenes, it's time to bring everything together. The next step is to merge these video clips into one seamless story, complete with sound effects, music, and cinematic transitions. You can use any video editor you like, but I'll be using CapCut. It's free, user-friendly, and perfect for crafting stunning story videos, even if you've never edited before. As you can see, I've opened CapCut and imported all the video scenes. Now, I'm simply dragging them onto the timeline. Next, it's time to add transitions between each scene. Now, a lot of the transitions here are marked as pro, but don't worry. There's a great free one that does the job beautifully. It's called Blur. Let's add the blur transition to each and every cut in the timeline. After adding the transitions, I'll zoom in on each clip, just enough to make the visuals perfectly clear and immersive. Zooming in not only brings attention to the key elements in the frame, but it also helps eliminate distractions from the background it creates a sense of focus and intimacy, allowing the viewer to feel more connected to what's happening on screen. This subtle effect enhances the storytelling, making the entire video feel more cinematic and polished. Next, I'll add sound effects to bring the story to life. For sound effects, I'm using Pixabay. It's completely free and copyright safe. First, I searched for baby laughing. <laughs> and the first result was perfect, so I downloaded it straight to my desktop. Next, I searched for baby crying and found one that fits the scene perfectly, so I downloaded that as well. In the same way, I downloaded other sound effects, like water flowing, a woman screaming, and even chick sounds, to match every moment of the story with the perfect audio. These subtle touches make a huge difference. They pull the viewer in and bring your animated world to life. In the same way, I downloaded other sound effects to match every moment of the story with the perfect audio. As you can see, I've downloaded all the sound effects and now I'll import them into CapCut. Now I'll place each sound effect exactly where it's needed to make every moment feel real. From the baby's laugh to the rushing water, these little details bring your story to life and make your audience feel every second. Sound is more than just background, it's emotion. The right effect at the right moment can turn an ordinary scene into something unforgettable. It helps build tension, set the mood, and guide the viewer's emotions without them even realizing it. With just a subtle sound, we can make a story feel alive, powerful, and deeply. I've added all the sound effects, and now the video is ready to export. So I'll click the export button, and make sure to set the resolution to 1080p for the best quality, the export has started, and once it's done, I'll show you the final animated story, brought to life with nothing but free AI tools. But before I show you the final result, if you found this valuable, give the video a thumbs up, share it with someone who needs to see what's possible with AI, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more powerful tutorials like this one. Your support truly means a lot. Thank you. Now. Let me show you the final animated story.